Bitch, I bet I could. Bitch, I bet I would. On the low, what's up with you, ho? Bitch, you smoking drone. Bitch, you know, must like 44. When I spit. Yo, what's up, guys? It's all stuff Madden here. And today, we have something so exciting that came out. It's the live event for End Games. That's right, the Elite came out. And you're, you already know, I got that boy Matt Forte. I completed it, and I was one of the first 15,000 people to get it. And look at him. Just look at that beast. Really, such a beast card. Such a beautiful card, and it's so rare. I mean, 96 carry, that's insane. 91 uh, agility, 89 acceleration, 90 awareness, 93 ball carrier vision. I mean, just a great card. Now, with that being said, I am going to do some gameplay on some head-to-head -head with this new Matt Forte card. And, uh, so currently I'm in All-Pro Tier 3. Um, I haven't really been playing head-to-head, -head, so any really requests or you know invitations that i get i kind of just decline them just because i've really been focusing on uh making coins and now that i'm kind of not focusing on making my coins but making my team better uh i've really been kind of focusing on head to head a little bit more now i've been gaining fans so right off the bat, Danny Amendola brings it to the 25-yard line. And now, let's just see this Matt Forte go to work. So, I mean, most of you do know I do have Patrick DeMarco. And let me just tell you, he is an absolute monster to have. Like, before I got the players, I was, like, questioning. I was like, wow, fullback. I mean, you know, it's it's whatever. It's a fullback. You barely use him. But he is such a good blocker. It's ridiculous. Like, this... This guy, like, he's absolutely, he's better than, like, so many of my linemen. So, right now, we're on third down, and I think I'm just going to do a run, uh, halfback pitch. See how that works. Breaks one. Ah, uh, fourth down. I don't want to lose right here. Alright, um, I'm actually going, my go-to third down, third and fourth down play is post corners. Because your wide receiver on the right, like, oh, I must have screwed. Oh, are you kidding me? But, as I was saying, I mean, a lot of the times your wide receiver on the right gets open. So, I mean, you have a good, about 15 yards there. So, I can't believe I just lost that. But whatever, it's alright, we're not stressing it. First game, it's a warm-up game. We're just warming up, you know? And if anybody's wondering, I'm not a Miami Dolphins fan. It's just I like to switch my team up a lot because I like getting different uniforms and, you know, new stadiums and all that for seasons. Damn, man. Danny Amendola. I don't really like this guy at the kick return. I like Tyler Lockett a lot better. So, I mean, this Matt Forte is a good card. He's that. It's more of the height, I would say. It's more of just... Knowing that there's only 15,000 cards, that's what makes it a little bit more hype and a lot better to have the card because it's not like one of the normal free cards that they give you like last year. I think they gave you a John Elway or something like that. But it's not one of those cards where everybody gets it. It's 15,000 people get it. Think about it. Six Sniper Away Kings alone has 14.8k subscribers, I believe. That's just in the, that's just in the Madden community, and not everybody follows them. And if you're just thinking about it, how many people that play Madden Mobile just aren't in the Madden community? Like it's crazy. Like there could someone I I seen the number today thrown out about three million people play Madden Mobile. I mean it sounds right. Wow, I'm a third down. So I don't know about everybody. Oh, I don't know about everybody else, but I'm really not liking head-to-head -head this year. It just seems like I'm always getting countered. Like, if that's not a first... Alright. just always seems like I'm getting my plays countered. Like, there are some times where I'll get all four of my plays countered, and it... Like, come on. Like, this, re this play call frequency, I mean, I understand it, and I like it to an extent. I mean, I shouldn't be getting... Every, like, four of my plays countered. It just shouldn't happen. So, now I'm on third down again. I'm not really getting any 
good runs with this Matt Forte. I mean, before I started recording, I was getting a couple, but this is just bad. This is just bad. Okay, let's see if we can just run it up the gut with him. We'll pick it up. This is a really long drive. Like, I usually never have drives this long. Usually, the first the first two I got, like, two 79-yard rush touchdowns. Let's see if you can find them on a halfback screen. Should work. Yeah, that's a touchdown. Well, maybe not. Alright, not bad. I'm going to catch them off guard, and they're going to, um... Okay, well, they don't have it. Never mind. Okay, let's see. Here we go. Can we run it in? It looks like we can. Hit another one. Come on. And we can't get him in. And it looks like I'm countered. Of course. Alright, if I don't score here, I I'm done. There we go. So we put up six after a long, long drive. That was very long. And... I don't know why it's doing this, but if you were playing the M Games live event earlier when it first was released and everybody was like rushing to get it, you probably experienced that lag circle a lot too because it was just, I mean, it was so bad that the servers crashed and they had to do a um, maintenance. It was ridiculous. Like this, like EA servers are constantly being crashed. And the fact that they actually thought it would be a good idea to make a live event with the first 15,000 people getting Matt Forte is actually really funny. Like, their servers cannot handle seven people, like, at one time. It's, it's actually crazy. But, before I go, I'm going to give you a little team update. The QB, we got Andy Dalton. He's one of the most accurate quarterbacks I've ever had. And we've got dual great wide receivers duo. we got Julian Edelman and Kelvin Benjamin. I really like them. My offensive lineman, lineman is a really solid. I have Marcus Gilbert, who is plus one overall. He was an 84. I got Kalishi O'Malley. He was an 83, I believe. Marquise Pouncey, he was an 85. Ramon Foster, he was an 80. He didn't go up. And Donald Penn, who was also an 83. But that's solid. Uh, Jonathan Joseph, he's he, uh, he was 83. Denoris Searcy, uh, I believe that he was 82. Justin Houston was 88. Luke Keekley was 89. Paul Kruger was 80. Um, Logan Ryan, I believe, was an 81. Carlos Dunlap was 83. Marcel Darius has, uh, was 83. So, as you can see, a lot of these players are just going up. Here you go, you got Dan Amendola. He was 77. Jarvis Landry, I'm pretty sure he was an 81. And Mike Sreifers, I don't know. He was an 83. Oh, I have a pretty solid team, and uh, I'll just quick sell like a bronze or silver player real quick. And open a pack, see what I can get. I mean, people have told me I've, I have amazing pack. Look, I've packed Antonio Brown, Gronkowski. I've packed uh, any elite on my team I've packed, uh, but I've mainly sold a lot. i uh, packed Ben Roethlisberger. So many more. TJ Lang. Uh, right off the bat, we get the gold, but... Yeah, it's not bad. I'm level 27, and yeah, I mean, this is my league right here, Suicide Squad. If you want to join, you can. We were one of the, f I think we were the third people to get Patrick DeMarco, but once we got DeMarco, everybody left the league, and no one's really been grinding for Eifert, which is a little bit sad, but it's alright. The boy too slow in here. Yeah, so... That's that, man. I mean, that was just...